Okay, what I'm about to share is my personal opinion on ways or drills to build a smooth infielder. Okay, and, and that's, um, you know, a really exciting journey to go on. So these thought activation drills, um, guys that struggle. So if we're creating smooth infielders, we have to be able to create the action, okay? The arm slot action of an infielder and the highest level infielders work from a slot. I was trying to mention earlier while the video was playing and I, I think you can see the video very rarely, like, you know, we teach equal and opposite when we talk about pitchers and sometimes outfielders, infielders are going to be more direct as we feel we're literally coming straight up here. Okay. To a scap load because we don't have time to get long on the backside. And when we're talking about throws all the way from deep short in the five, six hole, that is 50 yards on a football field. That's 150 feet. Okay. Very hard to repeat when we're creating all this length on the backside, we're trying to get rid of the ball quick. Okay, your release points are going to be uh, varied and balls are going to fly and sail everywhere. So we've created this series, okay, that we really work on V-slot activation. So until somebody has their V-slot down, okay, and when you take the ball out of it and just clap, it makes it much easier for them to focus on this arm action. So he's creating two different footwork patterns right now using the same clap into a V-slot. So, you know, that's what we're working on here. We'll move on. We got dribbles, elbows out when we feel, when we receive, we're coming to, to our core. We say center of chest. We mean ribs to belly button. That's where he's going. And he's showing you the V slot. Okay, adding in a dribble. Here we got an L uh, box, right to left, left to forward. Dribble out front, hinge at the hips, flat back. But the focus is the V right here. Notice the short arm action getting ready to throw.